hello and welcome back. This is Anya Grimone. I'm the host of Life Lower Prevention Project. And today we're going to continue our conversation around eliminating and or at least reducing stress. And today we will do that by trying not to repeat the same mistake twice. You see, our brains are very lazy and generally prefer to run from memory rather than coming up with new stuff all the time. So when we're under stress, usually our logical brain um, dims and we go to the automatic pilot so we have a broader bandwidth for survival activities. So when we stress, we tend to go on automatic pilot based on what we already know. Now, that may sometimes get us in trouble. I'm personally not very quick on my feet. So when I am in some new stressful situations, I very often will just draw a blank. I have no idea how to respond. And only later I say to myself, well, I should have said this or I should have done that. Well, there's an opportunity to not repeat the same mistake, not get stuck, not get dumb, not get numb and actually be able to handle this next time around. And how we do that is you have an opportunity at the end of the day to analyze the situation and replay it in your head as if it went perfectly. What does that do? It creates a memory. Your brain makes absolutely no difference whether something's real or imaginary. So by replaying that particular situation and behaving in that imaginary scenario the way you would like to behave, respond the way you would like to respond, you have now created effectively a memory in your brain from which you can draw upon next time you find yourself in similar situations. If you do that every single time you make a mistake, there's a plenty of learning to be had and you are creating a, a plethora and a filing cabinet of appropriate responses that will help you navigate difficult situations going forward. So my invitation for this week is practice every time you make a mistake, go back, analyze it, replay it, learn from it, and see what happens next time somebody's going to try to push the same button. Subscribe and, and, and save, share this information if you find it useful, and uh, join me for the next episode of Life Blowout Prevention Project next week. Until next time.